Can-Am has a well-earned reputation for innovations which expedite the entire building envelope erection process through an effective collaborative approach. The focus of this case study is the Courtyard Marriott Hotel adjacent to the Saskatoon Airport for owner Triple One Properties. Yeah, so we're at the, our brand new uh, Courtyard by Marriott, Saskatoon Airport. We opened in 18 months from beginning, the day we put the shovel on the ground and, until the day we opened the door. Like I said, we had the Marriott team in here before and they found it very fast and they found the quality impeccable and, and our guests have commented on that too. They're like, like, you know, they've never stayed in a hotel where it's so quiet and we're literally feet away from an airport. Can-Am collaborated with Triple One and their architect from the inception of the project. 3D modeling was conducted to ensure all of the project's many components were properly and efficiently integrated. The scope included design, supply, and installation of the complete building structure. The innovative design was centered upon the selection of Can-Am's Hambro composite floor system, which solved a number of key challenges. The Hambro system makes full use of Can-Am's collaborative approach to further enhance the integration of all project elements. This um, expedited the erection, everything is bundled up. The joist marks are um, you know, written on it and it corresponds to the layouts that we use here to erect, right? This is a really good approach because you just take the whole bundle, five joists, six joists at a time, you put it up there and you spread it. You don't even have to worry about you know, putting them in the order because the bundle is coming up in the order. This feature of Can-Am's collaborative approach, fewer lifts and less material handling, enhanced the safety throughout the entire erection process. Uh, it's been really well to work with. Uh, when it comes off the truck, if it's evenly stacked, it's much better. Um, uh, it goes up very well. Um, as long as there's two competent workers up there that can spread the joists, flying them up in bundles works great. They, like, they can keep up with the crane. The crane, the crane uh, it doesn't take long at all. This system's great as far as uh, efficiency and timing. We put the bundles in the uh, base, yeah. uh, put the roll bars in there, put the plywood on top, and then you pour the concrete. You can walk on it in 24 hours, 36 hours off, depending on the temperature, right? And, then, and that's just fast, you know. It saves money because you don't have a Q-deck involved, like, you know. And uh, you have plywood that you make the form, you pour the concrete, 24 hours later, you're up, you can erect your walls. But uh, sure enough, uh, going on a, a pouring a six inch slab on uh, shoring would have taken more time to install. In our case, uh, the Hambro system forms and unforms uh, pretty rapidly and the, the advantage of it is that you don't have anything in your way once uh, the floor is poured and you don't have any prop, you only have the load-bearing wall system. These are all the stud walls. We had a, a mobile uh, plan over here set up down there and everything was fabricated and ready here. It's been here for about two and a half months now. You know. And we divided uh, each floor to two divisions, one and two, or A and B, if you want to call. On average, we were putting um, something about seven days per floor, seven to eight days. And uh, basically, we have three and a half days to make one section ready for the poor while we're moving to the other se section. Despite the tight labor market and Saskatoon's infamous weather, the ambitious timelines were met. In fact, having the floor, wall, and roof system within Can-Am's collaborative approach enable parallel execution of what are normally sequential processes. This resulted in such a rapid erection of the building envelope that it set the pace and standard of precision for the parade of trades that followed right through to the opening day of the hotel. The building erection went incredibly fast. We, were, we probably gained the most time in that and really it's a challenging environment to build in, namely because labor is so short and skilled labor at that is not very prevalent here. Work was being done on many fronts at the same time and not necessarily at site. Even though there's a sequence of events, you can do multiple things at once and obviously that's where time is saved. So as we're erecting the building, the wall system is being created. As they're erecting uh, one floor, they're already built the next floor. Um, for example, the facade of the building, we were erecting the system using obviously the Hambro system. Uh, the contractor was putting the steel walls up. As he was going up, we had walls going up. So we were enclosing the building every floor as we went up. We, as we can see in the background, there we're getting ready quite a few panels on the floors for uh, finishing and getting it installed on site. It's the best thing to do this kind of stuff. 
in a climate like this one, where it's going into a very hard win winter time, so where this can, the thing cannot be done on site because of the temperature. So this is the best thing to close a building, and we are committed to, in two weeks, uh, to close the entire, we can say the entire south elevation. So you can see that people witnessing the development of this project can see that this building has gone ridiculously fast. I think this, the facade of the building went up in two and a half weeks, which is unheard of. To have an entire EFIS system with um, non-load bearing studs and the wall system completely done in two and a half weeks. That's on, on a six story building, is incredible. I was at the beginning skeptical about their aggressive schedule by looking at how far they came along in the last uh, month, month and a half, I think I, uh, I, the skepticism is gone now. <laughs> so I'm seeing other projects where, where a project should be done in, in such and such time and time it just uh, definitely gets carried away and carried on. In summary, the Hembro D500 composite floor system is fast and easy to install with a wide range of valuable benefits. Less concrete and reinforcing steel and conventional slabs, shortening erection schedule, reducing building weight, and thereby minimizing cost. Integrated plenums for easy installation of mechanical systems. Long span joists without shoring to reduce the number of load-bearing walls. Enhanced rigidity and strength from the steel and concrete design. Excellent acoustical rating and fire-resistant rating of up to three hours. We've still fared pretty well in comparison to not only the competitors down the street who are still not open um, and start at the same time, but even to those who develop hotels normally. And of this caliber and scale, like of being concrete and steel, uh, for example, the one down the street is a wood frame construction, so traditionally that should go up faster. Um, so it's not the fact that you use simpler materials makes construction faster, it's how you, well you use the materials. I think that's one of the strongest components we have. Can-Am's collaborative approach speeds up the construction process. It starts early on when Can-Am steps in during the design stage. The approach promotes collaboration with professionals and key project stakeholders to ensure optimal project design and execution.